Once you have created an expense claim, you can reimburse your employee and apply the charge to a customer. Only an administrator or super user can pay an expense claim. And if you have the approval process activated, after it has been approved. You can see unpaid expenses in day to day, expense claims, approved tab. Double click on the expense claim to open it. To reimburse the employee, just click on the reimburse button. A make payment window opens at the bottom, so select the paying account, add any reference and click save. The status of the expense changes to paid and on the right, the save and reimburse buttons have disappeared. The history link will give you a chronology of events on this expense claim and if you ever need to investigate this event in the future. You can add any notes here if you wish. Click close to return to the expense claim list. The item has disappeared from the approved tab and is visible in the pay tab. To apply this expense to the customer, create an invoice for the customer and you will be prompted to apply the outstanding billable item. Select yes and then add time and expense window opens. Click on the expense tab to see items waiting to be assigned. Tick all those to apply for this invoice. Below the table is a markup box where you can apply a percentage or an amount. Enter a value and when you click out of the markup box, see the amounts change in the bottom right. There is an options button on the right which will allow to vary the standard choices for this transaction for this instant like printing choice, application of a tax code, we'll select GST here, change expense account and markup accounts and others. When done, click on Save and see the totals change for the tax amount. Click Add and you will see the item in the invoice table. The arrow on the left indicates that there are more lines to this entry. We can collapse it for convenience when adding other items to the invoice. When done, click on Save. You can then print or email it or accept payment. Thank you for watching this video. For processing timesheets, see our separate video, Processing Timesheets. If you have any questions regarding time and expenses, please go to reckon.com forward slash support.